Back at it. February the 2nd, 2021. Going to do a little something different today than the uh, upset alerts. This is going to be a uh, NBA decipher today on the uh, NBA games. Today they have six games on the board. Today uh, went ahead and pulled up the uh, Vegas Insider. Uh, you know this is a this is a big time. This is a big you know this is a big time right here. You know this is a big deal. Uh, you know people take this very serious. They they spend money to uh, buy these picks. As you can see, uh, they have a, a, a icon there to where you can purchase the picks from their experts and uh, you know, I don't claim to be an expert I don't claim to go undefeated and you know to get every single read correct it's gonna be times when uh, my frequency is not gonna be fully online to where what I'm seeing and what I'm you know observing and, and analyzing is what's gonna actually happen but there's gonna be times where it is going to be online and it's going to be exact and precise and it seems like we're starting to come into that to that mode now you know i feel like uh my power is starting to come online to where my ability to decipher the outcome of these events is starting to uh increase to where my accuracy is starting to improve so I want to go ahead and do these games for the uh, channel today, and you know, let me know what what uh what you all have, and we can discuss it in the comments further. But today I'm looking at the uh, first game. I'm looking at the uh, Grizzlies. If they win today, it'll be their eighth win in a row. That's a very strong uh, possibility for the completion of their. Uh, win record to complete at eight at least they may you know it may extend past eight but I see them getting the eighth win today it will be the 19 head-to-head -head win versus the uh, Pacers and you know 19 is an eight prime the second game with Orlando I see Orlando getting their 10th ATS uh, win today um they get their 10th ATS win. Their ATS record will be 10 and 12, and Orlando Magic equals 112. Uh, the Clippers can get their 17th win today. Uh, the Clippers uh, will become 17 and 5. LA Clippers equals 175. The Utah Jazz can get their 16th win today. They will be 16 and 5. Utah equals 165. The game will be played in Utah. Though I do feel the uh, Pistons will cover. Uh, I think they had them at, they had the uh, Jazz winning by 12, so I feel like the uh, Pistons will lose by less than 12 points. The Warriors today can become nine and four at home. Golden State equals 94 and two ciphers. The Washington Wizards can get their 56 head-to-head -head win today. The game is going to be in Washington, and Washington equals 56 in the keypad. So those are the six NBA games. Um, you know, all of them may be wrong. You may need to fade every one of these picks, but all of them might be right. So, you know, based on what you have, you may see uh, some similarities and. You know, you may want to go with those specific games, but the uh, the NBA on the website they got Paul George on the cover, so I expect Paul George to get a double double, a triple double, have a big game today, and the Clippers to to win. So that's a very strong one right there. The uh, Memphis with the eight is is very strong as well. And looking at the way the lines. Uh, have came on for the last two games. It looks like the, the Golden State and the Warriors are both going to win today. And uh, they could both, maybe both lose today. But I have them both winning, so got to be very careful. The NBA is very tricky. Um, you know, when you're using certain techniques to, 
you know, make these reads, it seems like once you start winning, it, it changes to where if you use that same technique, it'll, it'll, you have to fade your picks because, you know, they'll go the other way. So they, they have it set up where they're going to win every time for the most part, but it's sometimes where we can actually, you know, turn over a little money, 50 cents a dollar, you know, a dollar on the, on the 16 parlays. You know, that's a good turnover. And uh, we'll see what happens. But let me know what you have, and um, we'll see how this turns out.